to talk A576. Um, I want to talk about the little altercation that Charlo, one of the Charlo twins, I don't, I don't, I don't know the difference between these guys, man. I, uh, the one is at 160. I think it's Jam Jamal. It's probably Jamal at 160, right? And um, Danny Jacobs, uh, they got into a, a discussion that started over social media. You know, they were going back and forth on social media talking about, you know, wanting to fight, each, fight, each, fight each other. And sometimes when you go back and forth, I know when you go back on social media, it, it can get disrespectful because when you're behind the computer or you're behind your phone, you know, people can get a little bit boastful and people can get more courage, you know what I'm saying? Because they're not in, in your face. A lot of times people say things over social media that they, they won't dare say in another man's face, period. And I know that because I, I've seen it. I, I've, I've been through it. I've I seen altercations between people say, oh, you said you said this about me on Facebook and now we're in front of each other. You're not saying that. So Danny Jacobs, you know, walking down the hall and then, you know, he seen the Charlo brother and he walked up to him and said, so what's all that stuff you've been saying over social media? And usually the Charlo brothers are really boastful. They really, you know what I'm saying? They really amped up. He calmed down because, like I said, a wolf recognizes a wolf, another wolf, <laughs> and there's only going to be one one king between those two wolves. Who's going to be the hierarchy? Who's going to be the hierarchy? And I th I thought Danny Jacobs won that stare down. He won that. He bagged Charlo up, man. He he bagged up. He he wasn't as fiery and boastful like he usually be when that. When nobody's, you know what I'm saying? When he's just talking to the cameras. And I'm not saying that he's not a quote unquote tough guy, but he didn't act as tough as he was acting prior to Danny Jacobs walking up. And that's what I said about people acting tough for the cameras, man. Because a lot of people are tough in certain situations until it's really time to be tough. And then you see who bags down. You know what I'm saying? I I remember being in um, grammar school. I think I was in seventh or eighth grade, one of them grades. And two of my friends, you know what I'm saying? Both of them, you know, they will uh, get down. They will uh, fight at a drop of a hat, man. So, but they never got into it. So no one knew who would win between the fight between them because, you know what I'm saying, they, they never had beef with each other. They never got into it. We were all friends. But something happened. Oh, I think I, I know what happened. You know, sometimes, you know, you crack jokes on somebody and, you know what I'm saying, somebody not feeling it on that day. And, you know what I'm saying, they, they just don't want to hear it. And one of my friends got mad at the other and slapped the other one in the face. So... We thinking, man, it's about to go down because we know both of these guys will get down. But the one that got snapped, slapped in the face, he started, he started crying, man. So we was like, I mean, not boo hoo crying, but you know, tears running down his face. So we was like, man, dude, he ain't gonna do nothing. Man, he he not as tough as we thought he was. So at the school, you know what I'm saying? We got outside. Dude, that got smacked. When they confronted each other and started fighting, dude, they got smacked, beat the dog shit out the other, out the other guy. So you never know who's tough and who's not tough until it's really time to show it. And I thought Danny Jacobs, I'm not saying Danny Jacobs gonna beat them in the fight if they fight, but what I'm saying is this: Danny Jacobs made Charlo, the Charlo brother, the fiery Charlo brother, bag down. He bagged down. And that's what I'm saying about that social media. That social media stuff will get you hurt, man. You can't just be boastful on social media so everybody in the world can see it and see how tough you are. See, social media don't keep you from getting beat up. You know what I'm saying? When somebody see you in, in real time. And Danny Jacobs seen him in real time. And what happened was, it wasn't like it was on social media. I'm saying, man, this social media has made a lot of guys tough, man. A lot of guys not as tough as they think they are or would like to believe they are.
real life situation is a real life situation. That media, that social media stuff, Facebook and Instagram and all that shit, that shit ain't that shit ain't that 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 shit is not reality when it comes to reality, if you know what I mean. So what I say is this, man, it's best to always confront a person in their face. If you can't confront a person in their face, then why are you acting tough? If you can't if you can't say if you can't say in somebody's face what you say over the, over the social media, then you're not really real. You're not really tough as you say you are because the simple fact is you were not in their face and you were comfortable saying it when they weren't there. See, I'm a guy that likes to be in front of a person. If I got something to say to you, I can say it to you in your face. And then whatever goes from there, whatever comes from there, comes from there. See, nobody... See. People don't really want a real altercation. They want the fake altercation on, on, on social media. That's, you know what I'm saying? A lot of these, a lot of people, I ain't just saying fighters. I'm just saying a lot of people in general will get on social media, get on Facebook and rah, 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 rah chat, 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 chat. And then when it's time for somebody in your face, you don't do nothing. But like I said, man, hey, y'all better keep that stuff in, in proper context. Keep that social media where it's supposed to be at. I'm out.